As mayor, how would you help develop the self-care district of Sheboygan? The city has already invested a lot of time and money creating the South Pier area, it's a great area, and has an development plan that's been in place and I think we should continue to follow aggressively. First, let's address the talk about a possible casino. Um, I believe there should be a binding referendum if there is any talk about a casino. But let me tell you, that's a long ways away. The county has to, the city has to approve it, the county has to approve it, the state has to approve it, the feds have to approve it. We're a long ways from that becoming a reality. But I too would be very disappointed in the common council and the mayor in the way it was handled. Um, behind closed doors meetings, secret negotiations. You know, I can't remember in the time I've been on the council any other property that was sold down on the South Pier District that was sold before we had a direct answer to what was going to be built there and to make sure that it met the plan that we have for the city. So I think we need complete details and knowing if it's going to fit in those plans. But I, have, I believe that the South Pier District development or development anywhere in the city needs to, I think, the, believe that the future growth in, in our community is based on our image. Whatever happened to Sheboygan being the best place to raise a family? Whatever happened to Sheboygan being one of the safest places in America? You know, in the past few weeks, we had two drive-by shootings. We had a murder, all believed to be part of the gang related. You know, I believe that one of the biggest hindrances to businesses and growth in Sheboygan is that kind of negative image, whether it's crime, drugs, gang activity, or all the distractions at City Hall, we need to repair that image so that people want to come here again and be part of Sheboygan. We need to fully staff our full police department because it isn't fully staffed at the current time. We need to talk about our great school system we have here. We have a great work, work ethic. Our people are hardworking uh, citizens in this, in this community. We have a, the beauty of our lakefront natural beauty that nobody else has except for Sheboygan. These are the assets we should be stressing. You know, I talked to a, a developer, out-of-town developer lately, and he's done some projects here in Sheboygan. He said, this used to be a great city in the past, but now it's all screwed up. I can't even get the time of day from the mayor who told me. We need to change that attitude and the negative image, and this will be a great city that we need to unite with the Common Council, unite with the citizens, and move the city forward. Thank you.